Suppose if you are working as a MS SQL Server developer, what should I learn for better career growth and for better package? So I'm going to explain three best career options. So based on your interest, you can choose the right job. So before going to dive into the main topic, if you have visited our YouTube channel for the first time, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel because I used to upload great content videos every day. Okay, so without wasting our time, let us start the main topic. What should I learn after having MS SQL Server experience? Suppose if you have uh, three years or four years or five years of experience as a MS SQL Server developer and you are not having a better career growth, you are expecting better career growth and better package, then you can choose any one option based on your interest job. Okay, the first one is you can learn uh, Power BI or Tableau. You can choose the Power BI developer or Tableau developer. So for that, you have to learn the additional skills along with the MS SQL Server. You have to learn SSRS, okay, uh, reporting service or integration service, okay. So along with these uh, skills, you have to learn any one data visualization tool, okay, and data warehousing concepts and data modeling concepts. So if you have good knowledge on these skills, then you can happily become a Power BI developer or Tableau developer. Okay, so based on your interest, you can choose. Suppose if you are very interested in developing side, then you can choose a Microsoft stack that is nothing but .NET developer. Because already you have familiar with MS SQL Server developer technologies. So you have to learn one programming language uh, related to Microsoft stack that is nothing but C sharp. And you have to learn one architecture and WCF or WPF, any one uh, tool you have, any one software you have to learn. So if you are very interested in developing side, then this is the best option for you. Okay, you can learn Microsoft stack related technologies and you can become a .NET developer or full stack .NET developer. Okay, so based on your interest, you can choose that technology okay and next one is if you are not interested in development side and if you are very interested on database side then you can choose the technology data engineer or big data engineer okay so to learn so to learn these technologies so you must have sound knowledge on sql any database so if you are already have great experience to write complex sql queries then i highly recommend you have to learn like a pyspark okay uh, etl concepts and shell scripting data warehousing concepts and any cloud service okay and even better you can learn any pi and you can learn python as well so if you are very good on these technologies then you can happily become a data engineer as well okay so it's totally depends on your interest guys if you want some easy job, then better to choose Power BI developer or Tableau developer. So if you are interested in developing side, then you have to learn Microsoft related technologies like a .NET developer. You can easily become a .NET developer by learning C Sharp, MVC, WCF, WPF. So like this, there are various career options are there who are having uh, MS SQL developer experience. So it's completely based on your uh, experience guys and you need a lot of dedication to learn all these new technologies okay so if you are a dedicated guy and a commitment guy then you can then you can happily switch to new domain and you can and you can expect a better career growth and you can expect a better package as well okay i hope this information is very helpful who are working as a ms sql developer or administrator if you feel this information is very helpful then don't forget hit the like button and also don't forget to share to your friends and your social networking platform as well so we'll meet with one more useful information video thank you very much